Salam labas kushi mezian, smiti Aaron. Hey guys, I am so excited. I just found Carmen's. I have been living here for over a year and I heard that there was like authentic like uh, Mexican, but now I want to correct myself because the man who makes it is Portuguese. However, it is kind of like Mexican food. I happened to stop at a rest stop here because my friend had to go to the bathroom and it was the best decision ever. Found Carmen's. I thought it was in Marrakesh. It's not in Marrakesh. It's right here at the Marrakesh rest stop, but we're still a hundred kilometers outside of Marrakesh. Um, the guy is really nice. He's from Portugal, speaks great English. Um, he found out he actually lives in Casablanca and he comes all the way here every day and works this food truck. But I ordered burritos, spicy, not spicy. I'm getting not spicy. And he also had pina colada juice. So I'm so excited. Let me all show right, you. So this guy's food truck is at the Marrakesh rest stop. And this is the view. Look at that, beautiful. And here is his truck. Literally looks like it's like from America. We're, America's really big on food trucks. The last probably like 10 years, decade. But um, his menu, let me show you his menu. I got burritos. I didn't tell him like anything. I just said, give me two burritos. One spicy, one not spicy. He does get products from out import, like he imports, uh, imports them. So uh, this is all really, really good. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. All right, guys, I arrived at my Airbnb. I found this place last second on Airbnb. And actually the woman, when I reached out to her, she knew me. So Fatima, shukran bazef for accommodating me. This is the living room. Go this way. There's a bathroom right here. One bedroom. Kitchen. Uh, for those that don't know that aren't from Morocco, it's very adi, normal, for kitchens to have doors on them. And I never thought I would like it, but having so many cats and wanting them to stay out of my kitchen, not a bad deal. And then there's another room. This one's gonna have a nice cross breeze because it has the double windows. And then, let's see, oh my God, look at the view. There's a mountain back there. All right guys, so I'm in Marrakesh and a little while ago, you know, I got the burritos. I did eat half of it in the car, it was amazing, but I wanted to show you now that I'm here. Um, half of it filled me up, so uh, they're small but mighty. So, Carmen's, he even got the stickers that actually, this is actually the sticker that is on his, that's his truck. Like it's his truck. Um, very nice packaging. Like I said, I already ate half of mine, but I'm gonna show you the other half so you can see. Very, very good quality. There's one, this is the non-spicy one. And then here is the spicy one. Very, very good. Give sauces. I'm a little scared because you know I don't like spicy because that looks really, really bizef. Bizef scone? Scone. Scone. Y'all correct me. Correct me in the comments. I love it. Another one. Again, looks very, very spicy. And then also chips, tortillas. They're like, they look like bougie Doritos. These are homemade. Everything, guys, everything is homemade. He makes everything. He comes from Casa every day to that restaurant, which is what, like over an hour, right? Um, he is Portuguese, he's from Portugal, and yeah, go check him out, Carmen's, it's at the rest stop, the Marrakesh rest stop, but don't be fooled for people that are not Moroccan, it's not Marrakesh, it's like a good hour and a half away from Marrakesh, 100 kilometers, but Carmen's, authentic, I don't know, do you want to say it's Mexican, but he's Portuguese, I don't know, it's really, really good food, if you like all that kind of stuff, go try it out. All right, guys, I'm on my way to the square, and this is through the neighborhood that's near me. As you can see, lots and lots of motorcycles and bikes, lots of pedestrians, a lot of street sellers. It's way more active here at night. I mean, it was busy, but I mean, like, all the street vendors coming out at night. It's 
So we are at a stop light and motorcycles just go. Marrakesh, what time is it? Eight o'clock at night? Holy crap. Bike right in the regular lane. Y'all need bike lanes here. He's going pretty fast. I am in Marrakesh. Um, tomorrow, Sunday, uh, is my birthday. You guys won't see this till Monday, so my birthday will already have passed. But spare the moment, last minute, decided to come to Marrakesh for my birthday. So uh, it is like eight o'clock already at night and I have not eaten, I'm starving. The last food I had was Carmen's up over at the rest stop. It was actually really, really good, authentic Mexican food. Burrito was amazing. But yeah, so I'm in Gemma, uh, Gemma and Fennel. Fennel, Gemma. I just had it, now I can't remember. Anyway, I this is my fifth time, Hamza. Hamza times in Marrakesh, and I'm so excited. And I was here last year for my birthday. So, let's go see what's happening for Saturday night in Marrakesh. There is no like shortage of vendors in Marrakesh. Um, Tafa, Tafa, Benan, Shakur, Asir. Guys, you hear all this. The reason that I'm learning. So many fruits and vegetables. What is this? Wait a minute, potatoes. Yeah, I want this. All right, guys, so this is potato. Hey Shwea ketchup, Shwea. Shwea ketchup. <laughs> Bismillah. <laughs> oh, is that ketchup? Yeah. Again? Say it again. Ketchup. Ketchup star. Star. Oh, star. Yeah, we know star. All right, guys, five dirhams, less than 50 cents. Shukran. Shukran. All right, guys, so we're here. We're going to get Asir. It's Shakur Asir. Sugar, sugar cane. Sugar cane, sugar cane. Um, this guy here, he's going to do it. I, now, you guys seen my other videos. I've gotten it in uh, Masira over in Tamara many times. Mezian Bazef. Delicious. Look at that. All right, guys, 
Shakur Asir Sugar Cane Juice Bismillah. Mezzi and Bizet. It's very good. All right, guys, here I'm definitely like not standing out. There are so many tourists here. People say all the time, why don't I live in Marrakesh? Two reasons, too hot, Bezef hot, and also too many tourists for me. I like the nitty gritty. I like being like, yeah. But this is, this is the, I feel like this is probably the main attraction in Marrakesh, or at least it's the busiest of every time I'm here, this is always like this. Uh, one time I came in the spring, it wasn't too bad, but it was also during the day and earlier. But if you come here at nighttime, this is how it is. The kids actually do not like it here because it's too many people for them. They came here one time last August and it was way too many people for them. All right, I'm gonna go find some dinner. I'm hungry. All right, guys, we are inside now. Like, I don't know, what do you call this? I really don't know what you call this. But it's indoors. Actually, there is a roof. Um, guys, back in New Jersey, those people that I know that are obsessed with like Columbus Market, seriously, eat your heart out. Like, Columbus Market has nothing on Morocco. This is like never ending shops. Shops and shops. Food and Zeph food. Pastries, breads, fish, meats, like anything you can think of, it's here. Good morning, good morning from Marrakesh. I am sadly going home today. It's my birthday and I gotta go home. But look at this view that I'm gonna have while I eat Brefix, Fator, cause you know, I don't know how to say Brefix. Um, the place is called, it's right around the street from my apartment. And I know that there are probably way bougier places in Galiz or go, you know, but to be honest, sometimes you just wanna go to a small cafe. So this one is called Love Reunion. But the view is literally insane. I think people said in my comments on IG, it's called the Green Mountain, but it's the mountain that sits like behind Giriz, Giliz, Giliz. But let's go have prefix. Yalla. All right, guys, my fator has come. Nasnas, Asir, Almu, Asil, Zibda, Zitun, Croissant, Badput. And this is bid but with zatar which is apparently some kind of seasoning i don't know if i've had it but it looks really really good this was all 45 dirhams now it is a little bit 35 dirhams 40 dirhams 40 dirhams i made a mistake um but you can't beat this guys because you're gonna eat this and like you're sitting here and if it wasn't so sunny we'd be able to see look at that 
That's my view while I have Fator, Marrakesh. All right, guys, my short little birthday trip from to Marrakesh is about to conclude, but I wanted to hit this little street sook on the way out, uh, show you what it looks like. It looks, it's literally, this is my thing. All these people on the street selling fruits, vegetables, hobs, everything, kushi, yella. So like I said, the street is a little bit crowded, but there are uh, people that sell the vegetables, hobs, um, fruits. There's a jewelry, hanuts, um, Very crowded with bikes. The Zef, the Zef bikes. Pastries, pastries. Okay, they look good. I'm gonna get Hadi, Wahed Hadi. Salam, uh, Bashal Hadi. We have fish, jez, fresh chickens slaughtered right in front of you if needed. Ah, of course, we got our electronics. You can't go anywhere, I don't think, here now and finding at least one electronics store. But this is the Morocco, guys, that I love. Like I said before, I wouldn't want to, like, live in the areas like this because I'm not a fan of the, you know, the trash and stuff. It's, you know, meshy mushkil. But I love visiting these places. I love shopping in these places. These are the people... These are my Moroccans. So like, yeah guys, there's like camels right there, ready to be ridden in the streets of Marrakesh. All right, we're heading into the Medina. Um, we're gonna go see Sophia. Sophia with Sophia, uh, she's from the Netherlands. She makes the waffles, the stroop. I'm not sure, guys, if it's not English, I, I don't know it, but it's stroop, I think, waffles. and. Um, uh, she saw that I was here and she told me to stop by. So we're gonna go get some waffles. And it's Sunday morning, actually Sunday afternoon, a little bit after 12. And you can see that it's not quite, it's busy, not like it was last night. So it's a little better, but give it another hour. I'm sure it's gonna be crazy. All right guys, I'm back, it's still in Marrakesh, I'm leaving today, but I had to come by and say hi to so Sophie for the waffles by Sophie. Uh, she has, what are they, stroop, stroop, they don't matter. Stroop. I love them. I know, I love them, but I can't say. I, I can't know. say nothing. But that doesn't matter. So today we're going to have Addy. We're going to have a normal grand. Grand. Uh, yeah, I had too much sweets with my breakfast this morning. But darning, it's her birthday today. Yes, so you get it from me. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's my birthday. It's your birthday. Happy 32 birthday. Thank you. Thank yes. You. Oh God, who's gonna believe that? Yes. You're looking good. You're looking good. Thank you. But you know what now? Being here now over here and in the sun, um, I need to start talking to these Moroccan women. What are they using on their face? Because I'm starting to notice like, so I want to get, they're using, what are they using? Like art or something? You can. Because I would use the hydrates and hydration for the hydration because we have a lot of sun. Yeah. So I would use um, for a moisturizer. Yeah, moisturizer, yeah. That's what I would I think that is very great. important yeah. for the sun and yeah. for our skin. Yeah. I also use it. Yeah, your yeah. skin's great. Thank you. But you know also, use an Aragon serum. Why yeah, yeah, serum? Do you know anybody here that sells it? But I'm going to let you see a photo. Yeah, let me see what I let me see. You guys see this? This is, oh my goodness. You want the original one, darling? Or you want a little chocolate? Oh, the chocolate's there. <laughs> you know, you can never say no to chocolate. I know. You never say no to yeah. chocolate. 
Yeah. I'm one of those people, I'll eat like dinner, and then right after I eat dinner, I have to have like something sweet chocolate. I know, I know what you mean. Hey, I'm happy to see you again. And how are the kids? How are they? They're cool. Oh, they, they like it, except they have to get up really early. I know. But school is school. Yeah. They're learning French and Arabic. I'm so like so excited about that, learning new languages. Oh, you're so proud. Because you know in America they don't get a language until ninth grade because America because English is a world language, darling. Okay. Saha. Shukra. Bismillah. Look at this. And happy birthday. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. All right. Bismillah. Oh my god. Why did I have this one before? <laughs> Who is caramel and white chocolate? Oh my god! It's nice, man. This is really good. You know what it tastes like? Cinnamon Toast Crunch. You might not know it. It's an American cereal. It literally tastes like Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Very good. Yeah. Alright guys, that wraps up my quick short birthday trip to Marrakesh. Just got some good food, you know, saw some stuff I never saw. I was never in that area. Really nice. And I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Islama.